Hi, in this video I'm going to show you how to set up and use landed cost into Scarab Books. So the first thing you want to do is go and click on settings, go to item landed cost settings, and click view details. Now inside here you can see all your different landed cost. You can click this widget in order to activate it. And if you wish to add in landed cost, all you have to do is click add landed cost category. And you can click add category here, put in the name, and then input the allocation type. So for example, you can put in weight, and then you can select the type. The different types we have is quantity, value, weight, manual, or custom duty. So you can select which one you want, and then you can of course save it. After that, you want to go to products. Either create a new product or select a product that you want to add in landing cost to. So, for example, I'm just going to select one of these. I'm going to open it and edit it. Then inside here, I can go select the landed cost. And if I want to, I can select more than one. Now, if it's weight, I'll have to go here under inventory and enter the weight. And then I can click update. Next, let's go to bills. Now inside here, let's go and create a new bill. Let's add a contact. Add in the product. So for example, landed cost product. And we can even add in the canister that we just updated before. You can input a unit price, update the quantity. And then we can save it. After that, we can go and receive the goods and click Receive. Click OK. Once that's done, we can click on Open and we can click on Landed Cost. So inside here, we're going to click Add a Contact and we're going to select the contact that's charging us for the landed cost. I'm just selecting one of them. Add in the expense. So for example, freight. Input the quantity. Input the unit price. Any discounts, amounts. And then I'm going to click on the three dots. And I'm going to click Allocate Cost. Now inside here, it can be by value, by quantity, or you can manually enter it. So I can just type it on in inside here. So you can choose on how you wish to allocate the cost. You can also choose the other ones here. So for example, since weight is also assigned to canister, it shows here. And manual or quantity. So you can choose based upon which ones you've selected already here, based upon the allocated landed costs you've created inside the system. And then you can just save it and save. Then inside here, you can click Receive Goods, and you can say the freight has been completed. And that was a quick look at how to set up and use landed costs in Discara Books.